what's up guys and welcome back to the channel so if you're new make sure to subscribe for more tech and money related videos so in this video i'll be showing you on how you can link your binance account to your google authenticator app so this action is important because it will increase security with your binance application and you know with binance we're dealing with money which is in a form of cryptocurrencies so make sure to watch this video until the end because all the parts are interlinked so without wasting much of your time let's get straight into the video so first things first you get to your laptop and you open your browser so for me i'm using chrome and then in the search engine you type binance or binance login so you click on the first option that appears after you've successfully logged in where you want to go now is on your top right so you click on it and it will bring you a drop down menu that will have a number of options and the option you want to click is security so you click on it and it should bring you to a dashboard that looks something like this after it loads so as you can see my google authenticator is not yet enabled so for me to enable it which is what this video is all about you click on enable so google authentication is simply a two-factor authentication which helps better secure your binance account because you know we are dealing with money and to be specific we are dealing with cryptocurrencies so after you click on enable to bring you to this dashboard and step one is saying download app so if you're using an apple device get to your app store type google authenticator and download the app and if you're using android go on your play store type google authenticator and download the app because without you downloading the app you will not be able to complete step two so after you successfully managed to download the app click on next and it should bring you to step two which is saying scan qr code so after you've downloaded the app after you have the after you have the app on your mobile device open it and then it will tell you get started so you click on get started and then and then it will ask you to scan the qr code so you point the back camera of your phone to the qr code that's appearing on your laptop screen you scan the qr code and it will automatically link your binance to your google authenticator but you're not yet done so after the two have been successfully linked you click on next and then step three is saying save this backup key in a secure location so you can write it down or back it up in your cloud the reason why it's important for you to save this to save this backup key in a secure location is because you will need it in a case where you lose your phone and because you won't be granted access to log into your google authenticator on another device unless you enter this backup key so after you've successfully secured it hit next and then it will bring you to your fourth option or your fourth step so step four is saying enable binance slash google authenticator so this step is just to verify your account so if i scroll down a bit i should have three options which is you verify your account using your phone number email and using your google code so click on get code and a six digit sms will be sent to your mobile device so copy those digits paste them on phone verification code move to your second step hit get code and a six digit number will be sent to your email copy the six digits and paste them in there and move on to your third and final step which is authenticator code so you so you go back to your google authenticator so you might have noticed upon successfully scanning your qr code random six digit numbers started running in front of your screen while you are logged into your google authenticator so go there open your google authenticator copy the six digits that run they've got an expiring period which is about 60 seconds so copy them quickly paste them here you'll be given the option to click next so once you click on next if the numbers that you entered were correct you reach your fifth and final step which is completion a green tick showing you that you've completed all the four steps needed for you to link your binance to your google authenticator so it will tell you at the bottom get back to safety so you get back to safety and we've successfully linked binance to your google authenticator so this is basically it on how you can link your binance account to your google authenticator so if you've learned one or two things make sure to give this video a thumbs up so thank you so much for sticking out this far stay safe and i'll check you in the next video peace